Okay, so let's talk about how to switch users on an Ubuntu server. Now, this is something that actually does raise some security concerns, so it's just something you want to be aware of. But the command is su. So we've already used su do, which says, you know, switch user to admin and, um, and then execute a command. Now, one other command I need to introduce to you real quick, and that is who am I? Who am I tells you who you are logged in as. And right up here as part of your prompt, it should tell you who you're logged in as. But sometimes that's not always the case depending on the shell settings. So who am I is always a way that you can tell. Another command just to be uh, familiar with is PWD, that's print working directory. And that will always show you your exact folder. Now the prompt should tell you that's what that little tilde is. It tells me I'm in my home folder. But PWD is just another way of looking at that. And with tilde, it doesn't tell you you have to know you're in home and PWD will show you a little more clearly. So um, let's talk about switching a user. So let's say I wanted to switch user to root, right? Because I keep having to use su do in order to do something. So if I do sudo or sudo and su, that will switch user to my root user. And now you see it says I'm in root. I'm no longer in my home folder. Now it says I'm in forward slash home forward slash David. If I do a who am I, it tells me I am logged in as root. And then exit will get me back out of there. Now also notice on the prompt when I was root, my prompt was a hash. Here it's a dollar sign. So that hash tells me you have full root permissions. So let me do this again. Let me switch user to P Peters. And whoops, SU P Peters. And that switches me to P Peters. Now that means I'm now acting as uh, Patrick Peters. Who am I? I'm Patrick Peters. If I do CD space tilde, which will take me to Patrick Peters home and print working directory, you'll see I'm in the home directory for Patrick Peters. For um, all intents and purposes at this point, I am functioning as Patrick Peters. Now this actually does raise some security concerns because it allows you to imitate somebody else. So just be aware of that, but it is one of the capabilities. So I'm going to exit back out, and now it takes me back to my account. Now, that can be useful, though, especially if we're like testing permissions or something like that. We can set permissions, switch to that user, and make sure that those permissions are working the way we want. Okay, so that's really all there is to it, to allowing us to jump back and forth between different users to test settings or permissions for them.